you're going to throw away an eight-year relationship because I'm 30? Well, yeah, your time clock came and went. You're expired now, like milk. Mm. Thank you so much for the most perfect birthday. I love you so much. I love you too, babe. I want to give you the world. And when I get that promotion, I promise I will. I can't believe I'm 23 already. I know. It feels like just yesterday we were passing notes in the lesbian dance theory. Stop! That is not what it's called. <laughs> I mean, I know, but I wouldn't do anything to put a smile on that face. How did I get so lucky? <laughs> I was just drunk, that kind of helped, you know. No, but seriously, um, I'm the lucky one. I'm gonna make you my wife one day. Oh, really? When is this happening? Um, hopefully soon. I really want to have healthy babies while you're still young. So what do you think? You ready to start a family? I was thinking maybe wait until I'm like 30 to start a family. Mm. Really? Isn't it better to have babies while you're still young? It's easier to lose weight after having a baby while you're still young. Speaking of losing weight. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Here, babe. I made that for you. It's so perfect. But uh, don't you think if you want to start a family and make babies, we should get some more practice? <laughs> you know what? Say no more. Big day today. I know. Hey, could you come upstairs when you're done here? There's something I need to talk to you. Yeah, of course. Okay, what do you want to talk to me about? Well, it's something important. Something that I've been meaning to do for a while now. I got that promotion at work, which made me thinking we I do. to break up. Wait, what? Don't be upset. It's nothing personal. I just got that promotion at work and... And what? And you're 30 now. I'm 30. I'm not dead. Yeah, but you know, I want to have kids and family and I can't have it with a 30-year-old hag. You're going to throw away an eight-year relationship? Because I'm 30? Well, yeah. Your time clock came and went. You're expired now, like milk. You're not thinking clearly. I mean, you're just stressed out because of work. It's okay. It's fine. Jess, can you stop? I'm breaking up with you. That's final. Besides, there's someone else. She's 21. She wants kids, okay? I don't want to be a jerk. I'll give you 24 hours to find a new place and get your things out. I'm headed to work. Jared birthday. In that moment, Jessica's entire life flipped upside down. Here she was on her 30th birthday expecting a proposal, and instead she got dumped for being too old. Jed, on the other hand, wasted no time with his new girlfriend. Things were exciting, new, and they couldn't be more in love. Jed was so excited to start a family with his new girlfriend that he showed up to the hospital ready to be a proud father. But to his surprise, he was shocked when the baby came out a few shades darker than he imagined.
Hey, J Jessica. Hey, I'm sorry, do I know you? It's me, it's Jet. Jet, oh my God, I, I'm i so sorry. I, I didn't recognize you. What are you doing here? I remembered you come to this park and, you know, so. <laughs> are, you, are you stalking me? Did, did you come here knowing that I would be here? S sort of. It's nothing weird. Uh, I just, yeah, saw you um, delete your number and I couldn't get a hold of you. And I remember you liked to come to the park and run. So. Okay. So, do you need something? I, I was thinking maybe we could just hang out. We could just. Catch hey, on. babe, you have a good run. Hey, yeah, I did. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. Um. Uh, no, this is Jet, my ex-boyfriend. Wait, you, you dated a homeless guy? He wasn't homeless when we dated. Oh, um, hey, nice to meet you. I'm nice Luis. Nice to meet you too. Do you need some help or anything, or? Oh, no, 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 I was just, yeah, in the neighborhood, so. Okay. Um, well, my mom called, said the baby's ready to go, so whenever you're ready. Yeah. All right, I'll give you a minute. Yeah. A baby? You settled with that guy and have a baby? It did. Wow, I mean, by looking at you, I just couldn't even tell. It wasn't just, um, do you ever, think that we could ever... No, not a chance. You left me for turning 30. I was the best thing that you had going for you. I met Louise and he loved me for who I was, regardless of my age. He didn't look at me like some baby-making machine that was put on this earth just to have babies. I guess I should say thank you because you taught me a very valuable lesson about love and what it actually means. I, I really dodged a bullet on that one. Take care of yourself, Jet. I hope you guys enjoyed today's life lesson with Luis. Make sure to like and subscribe to this channel so you get notified every time we release a new video. And as always, make sure to share this with someone that you love.